here getting this money while niggas jealous of my life. Make sure everybody eating, we living in paradise. Got a kingdom to protect and for this, I'm ready to die. All I see is blue faces and they keep on multiplying. I'm addicted to this money, my addiction isn't a crime. I'm running from it, she running to me. Yeah, she meant for me. The more I get it, the more I keep feeling that it's matrimony. Never faking, never phony. Man, I'm standing on mine. Ready to handle business no matter the place and time. Yeah, it's loyalty. If you in my circle, then you're royalty. It's royalty. If you're in my circle, then it's loyalty. Yeah. Gotta keep your friends close, but keep your enemies close. Everybody love you and you up like Sammy Sosa. Proper preparation, this suckers hate me. Man, I'm stacking this money. My kingdom going crazy. Big bank, take little bank. These suckers hate me. Genesis, Exodus, down the revelation. I get my daily dosage like it's medication. Studying day and night, night and meditating. Cause this word keep me lifted like I'm levitating. Genesis, Exodus, down the revelation. You need your daily dosage like it's medication. Studying day and night, night and meditating. Cause this word keep me high Not from the moment I awake And I pray and I praise him Then open this word up Then flip through the scriptures Like acrobats doing a circus Then plant this word deep down inside Like a farmer do To keep more heat coming out my grill At the enemy than a barbecue And I'm addicted to his word You can say obsession Sometimes I overdose And end up high as George Jetson From the wisdom and the knowledge I inhale And the truth be hitting harder Than a hammer doing it yeah, and I would never go a day without it And let my flesh fall out and turn up like he bout it, bout it So I make sure that I prioritize my study time And rid of all distractions, hang them high up like a power line Yeah, Genesis, Exodus, down the Revelation I get my daily dosage like it's medication Studying day and night, night and meditating Cause this word keep me lifted like I'm levitating Genesis, Exodus, down the revelation You need your daily dosage like it's medication Studying day and night, night and meditating Cause this word keep me high, spiritual elevation Now whether rhema or written, I'm accepting and I'm receiving Cause whether reading or speaking, he blessing me like I'm sneezing My spirit hunger and need it So I'ma stay feasting on the word until I'm spiritually obese Best believe it His word's a lamp under my feet and light to my path And it fills me up till I'm full like a tank of gas So whatever plans the enemy attempt I'm speaking God's word and leave them shattered like bro Broken glass, yeah. Let me encourage you to open up this word and taste the living water like a coconut. It's a necessity. So plug yourself into this word to keep you going like an energizer battery. Yeah. Genesis, Exodus, down the revelation. I get my daily dosage like it's medication. Studying day and night, night and meditating. Cause this word keep me lifted like I'm levitating. Genesis, Exodus, down the revelation. You need your daily dosage like it's medication. Studying day and night, night and meditating. Cause this word keep me high, spiritual elevation.
Hey, preacher. Kind of cold, but thanks for meeting me. No, no problem. To to you. No problem. What you want to talk to me about? There are several things. What is that? Oh, one, my husband, your brother. Well, where is he? Well, you know, me and Q ain't got a relationship like him and Marcus. We yeah, don't. Marcus. He pops up out of nowhere, and I don't even know him. He wasn't even at the wedding. Well, that's how he is, and I can almost guarantee you that there's something between them two. Marcus and Q, they they think it's Steve. And I can guarantee you, you know about whatever it is going on with them. You know. Now don't start that like everybody holding something and you ain't holding nothing, cause you know I know some secrets, right? I'm really not playing both. Of you. I'm, I'm gonna let it be out. I'm telling you now, I'm gonna I'm putting it out there. I'm gonna go to Queen House anyway right now. Let her know what's going on. Well, why would you wanna do that? That's gonna start a whole lot of mess with this one. What you think gonna get started when they find out that I knew about it and them my best friends and I knew about you and Keisha and I knew about you and Queen? You and Keisha. You know what I'm Preacher. saying? Keisha went off on the Preacher, deep end. you got to fix this because when all this come out, because it's going to come out because I'm going to tell them. Tell well, me right now. Why would you want to tell them? That's going to start a whole lot of mess because with this Because if you don't tell it and I don't tell it and it comes out that I know about it, I'm in the middle of this with my best friends. i tell you what. You might want to tell it before me and I'm on my way over there right now. So I'm going to tell it and I'm telling you that right now. So get it together and please be on the lookout for my husband. Nice all right, to meet you. All right, see you later. Genesis. Oh my God. I've been trying to call you. You can't answer call my phone me for calls what? anymore. You can't answer my calls. No. For for what? I've been trying to apologize. Uh, to apologize you. for what? <coughs> for how I treated you the last time I saw you. Apologize to me? Oh, now you want to apologize? Yes. <laughs> apologize for what? Stop. Listen. No, 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 stop. No, it's, you apologize to me now? After putting the gun on me, I went to go get your address from my bartender. I felt embarrassed. Just to bring you your bag. And you pull a gun on me? This is how you treat me? Someone that's trying to be nice to you? Is this how you treat me? Do you hear me talking to you? Negro, did you just put your hands yes, in I my did. face? Yes, I did. Did you just snap at me? Yes, I did. You know what? Next time, maybe I will pull the trigger. You know what? Shut down. I'm still mad. Lawsuit, you know what?
Who is it? What up, little sis? What's going on? Get your ass in here. Well, nice to see you too. What's going on? Sit down. So what are we, you want to talk to me about? What am I over here for? What's going on? What you want to talk to me for? I was in the neighborhood anyway, so what's going on? You know what, Preacher? Why is you out here being weird to the family? It's not okay. Why? Is it because you dating this bald head, ratchet, queenie that you've been running around town with? She ain't even it. And you got me back out here from Chicago and stay in this Airbnb that I don't want to be in to come out here and fix your mess. So that's what you call this? Fixing my mess. Getting in my business is fixing my mess? That's what you call this? If you can't see it, I can see it. And the way you moving in these streets is not a good look. Straight up. You know, you and Mark is saying the same thing. Both of y'all. Both of y'all saying the same thing. You call this family getting in my business. Like I said, that's what you call this, right? You know what? If two people is telling you the same thing, you should really look at your own self because it's not us. It's you. We love you and we want the best for you. But at the same time, you're not about to ruin our reputation behind this bitch. But you know what? The next when Q comes back around again, you and Marcus, all three of y'all, I'm gonna make sure I get y'all out of my business. Cause this right here, I'm not gonna stand for it. But matter of fact, Q will be back around soon. And on that note, stay the hell out of my damn business. I'm gonna leave on that one. You know what I'm saying? Stay out of my business, sis. Preacher! I'm not playing. Stay out of my damn Preacher. business. Preacher! Anyway, bye. <sighs> <clears throat> supposed to be great that's why i worship the greatest you are supposed to be mad that's why you hang around the hater i am supposed to be saved 
That's why I live for the Savior. You are supposed to be last. Do your job when you live for Satan. Right around the time that you notice my greatness, your history already faded. Nobody worshiping Jesus is regular. Guess why them normals be hating? I fell in love with the blood that made me show love to my neighbor. I always stay right in your view so you can't say you ain't seen a savior. All of this fruit I produce came from God or myself. I am worthless than nothing. I am supposed to be great when I serve the one who bought me from all my slum. Funny how Satan served God, but you stupid enough to try to run from it. All of my praise go to God. What he give it ain't always for stomach. Some would he give for the heart if he changes your play in there, I am supposed to be great. That's why I worship the greatest. You are supposed to be mad. That's why you hang around the haters. I am supposed to be saved. That's why I live for the Savior.
knew that was you. Not today, man. Not today, Marcus. Not today, man. We just buried our brother, man. So you know, I'm not, not, not today. You know, but uh, did y'all, did, did y'all finish the wait? If you were up there, you would have known we were done. You know, I'm not about to break down until you, Egypt, and uh, all of y'all. I'm not about to do that. You know, I'm not. You already know that. Are you not your brother's keeper? I am. But you know what? That brings me to something that Q told me. He made a phone call to me, bro. Me and Q had a conversation. He asked me about God, about Christ. He asked me about how do you know if you're gonna get into heaven. He asked me about the sinner's prayer. It's like he knew somebody had this thing over his head, like somebody was out to get him, like he knew that, bro. In the middle of the conversation, as we were talking, he asked me, he said, you know, don't tell Naomi and don't tell Marcus. Cause he know how you would get, bro. He knew you would get like this. And he asked me not to tell you, and that's what I did. You know the difference between me and you? If Q had called me talking like that, I would have stopped everything I was doing and got there ASAP. Bro, you live way in the mill. There's no way you could have got her fast enough. There's no way you could have did that, Marcus. It don't matter, it would have got done. Marcus, you carry the weight of this world and this family on your shoulders. You are one man. There's no way you can do that. Bro, it's my job to know everything about this family. Yeah, you are right to know everything, but what you gonna do when Egypt find out? What you gonna do when she find out what happened at his bachelor party in the bathroom? She got her foot on our necks already trying to find out what happened. What you gonna do then? Bro, I don't care about Egypt. You need to be worried about Egypt. Egypt's on a rampage right now, and she destined to find out what happened to her husband. What we need to do is put this thing to a side that me and you dealing with, because we gonna deal with that and find out who did what they did to our brother. We? Ain't no we. I'm gonna figure this out. You can continue to run around town being this preacher. Really, Marcus? Marcus? It don't ever take you this long to answer the phone. Bet you had Bible study or something. For real? Now we taking more than three rings to answer the phone. Please leave your message for six, one, two, Call me when you get this message. I don't even know why. You know what? I do know why you're not answering the phone. You probably at Bible study, praying for me and everybody else. But you know what? When you're done with that, call me.
Cause we so close together, but yet so far apart, right? Okay. A story of us, no ash to dust. Knees to no butts, now when cleavage we touch. This shit matter much now, and God we trust. This is the surface we touch. Did I speak it at enough? My heart she crushed, and other words get fucked. We scattered the lust between me and you on giving up. Seeing all the changes that bust, rearrange those spots. You said a lot, you said you gon' give him the box. Stay in that lane, don't rush. Be this point, I must. Please shed no tears. I'm standing right here, never really run in my fears. But it is you I hit, my importance are clear. You said I was damaged, come on, dear. This path is for fear. This right here is getting weird. Supposed to be. What's going on, man? How you doing? Why would you leave my house like that the other day? Did you think that was okay? Nah, I mean, I didn't think it was okay, but y'all was kind of getting in business though. I'm you know your little saying? sister. That's what I'm here to do is make sure you straight. I understand. Make sure you and Marcus is straight. But no, you want to run around town with this girl queen for what? She all right, but she ain't all that. But did you have to say it like that? I mean, I'm just saying. Okay, well, maybe, maybe y'all need to you right. Actually, you right. I think we should meet. You should set that up. But when y'all do, she ain't the type to sit there and just stand there and just let you talk to her. I don't, I don't even care. You know what? I want to meet her. If she want to be a bitch, I can be a bitch right back. I okay. could be a bigger bitch, okay. actually. Well, I'll, I'll make it happen. So, are you going to be like this when you meet her? Set it up. Let me know what time it's going to be. I'll be there. Call me. I'll wait for it. So can I get a hug? Goodbye. Let me know what time.
This has been a hellish, a hellish week. Am I losing my mind? Like what? What is going on? I don't, I don't understand what's going on in my life. Who is Chloe and why is she just always here? Popping up everywhere. Just out of the blue. Genesis. I don't even know what to do with him. I don't know if I like him. Or if I don't like him. It's too much. I don't even have a mom I can talk to about these things. Like, well, not really. What happened to us? to live this mediocre life and I'm just tired. I can't talk to my mother. I don't even know if I like her. Like, just why? What do I, what am I going to do now? I got to get away. I, I can't do this. I can't have these people just wrecking my life like this. I can't talk to mom. Genesis won't go away. Chloe's popping up. I, I can't do this. I gotta go. Where, where am I gonna go? I gotta go. I gotta go. I, I gotta go. I, I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. I can't. Where am I gonna go? No. Pull it together, pull it together, pull it together, lady, pull it together. This is not how you do. Pull it together. Uh, okay. Okay. We're gonna go. We're gonna leave this place. We're gonna leave Minnesota. Where are we going? We're gonna go. Uh, mm. A place that nobody knows me for a fresh start. Chicago? Yeah, Chicago. Yeah, Chicago. We're gonna go, we're gonna go to Chicago. I'm not even gonna tell anybody. I'm just gonna pack my things and go. That's it. Naomi, pick up. Damn, I missed the phone call. Ah. Ah. It's all good. Hey, Scully! Hey, Scully! What's up, man? Let me holler at you real quick. Alright, what's up? So, you know my brother Q? Nah, bro. Come on, Scully! 
Take a walk with me, man. Man. So, what's my name, man? Marcus. So you know Marcus? Yeah, bro. Then you should know my brother Q. Nah, bro, I don't know Q. So there's something that happened. And I heard you the go-to guy for all the information. So I know you know what happened to Q. Nah, bro, I don't know what, nothing. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what, man. You always got your ear to the ground. And whenever there's some information that need to be got, you my mans. Nah, bro. Okay, Scully. I'll tell you what, man. There's people like you, man, that really piss me off. <laughs> Next time I ask for some information, give it to me. Put your blood all on me. Boom. That being what? Yeah, my legs. And you're here for... You know, I knew something was up. That being what? <laughs> I'm trying to talk to Queen. You still breathe. Yeah. So what does that tell you? You missed. Right? So, let me guess. You're here to shoot me again. So I'll stop talking to her. But I'm not gonna leave me alone. That's not gonna happen. Two choices. That being what? Number one, you be clean, alone, forever. Number two, they won't miss. So here's the thing, Keisha. You must don't know about my family. Or do you? You must don't know about my family. You must don't know. What are you talking about, Marcus? <laughs> Marcus, huh? How you know Marcus? Well, Keisha, I know everything. Okay. And what I do know is next time they won't miss. So you know how I get down. So that should be easy for you to move around. Yeah. So you're not gonna miss this time, right? Right? Because I'm not gonna leave Queen alone. They won't miss. Oh! Didn't you just lose a brother? Kiss, you need to leave right now. You need to leave. Now. I'll leave. But you gotta get your money back with that game too.
twice in time. Yeah, it's loyalty. If you in my circle, then you're.